So, I'm thinking, let's uh, drive out to Navarro by the sea and look around for some rocks out there where we have some sunlight. Where you never know on this beach, it can be hit or miss. It can all be sand sometimes and little pebbles and then sometimes. There's just endless little gravels. Now they're littles, but not too little. Some beautiful little polishing pieces. I'll gather up some pieces in the dry here and then we'll look at them in the wet. Nice little pieces of chert. Look at these beautiful greens. Let's get them wet. Beautiful greens on that one. I hope it's picking up. Just gorgeous. piece of seaweed. I believe most of these to be a just different mixes of chert, the greens that I'm showing you. Ooh, the mixes in that semi-plain quartz. Yeah, these are all going to go in a tumbler load together. A memory mix. little piece of red abalone shell. Nice mix of red and green shirt. When you see the red right with the green, it's an instant giveaway for you that you know that you're dealing with a shirt in my area. So that is just a really cool serpentine, but it's, wow.
big old gob of green goodness. piece of uh, chert also. Just picked this one up and it is awesome. It, it's some sort of uh, brachia, so it's like a conglomerate of sharp edges. I think it's a a chert that's uh, yeah, reconglomerated brachia chert feature. I give the best rock descriptions. Look at this shiny thing. That is the stone of the day so far. That is just. Look at that, it looks like a cemented countertop, but just made out of green goodness. This is super fun, look how fine the pieces go. Photo bomb! I believe the tide is coming in. See, you can tell a green shirt because uh, the layers, you can tell a bedded or a ribbon shirt because it, it's a layer, it's a sedimentary stone, so that's one of your main clues. Having to carry a wet piece of seaweed. For some reason I thought there'd be more water on all these rocks and I wouldn't need the spray bottle. green 
Jeans, look at the color of this. Mm. Nice little green little for the polisher. It's almost a blue. So many of these little translucent littles. Here's the latest little batch of finds that I picked up just in this area that you're looking at. A little piece of fiery colored jasper. But that's not what I wanted to show you. I wanted to show you the three things that I just picked up. They're right here in front of me. Now these are atypical these are actual little arrowheads from this river system. I've found these out here my whole life. Now, of course, I'll be leaving them here because you're not allowed to collect arrowheads from a state beach. But I wanted to show them to you before they get destroyed because... Here they are. They're little chips. And I know that um, some of you might think I'm pulling your leg, but these are little semi-precious jaspery and uh, chert pieces that have been mapped into these little teeny tiny little arrowheads. And all of the little nappings have been sanded off by being in this big rock polisher that we call the ocean. And I have people that comment that, um, all kinds of stuff, we won't go there. That one's broken. It's just a tip. You know, crazy is crazy. But there are three little actual bird tips. And, let's go ahead and grab a bottle of this sand. Let's find the finest sand that we can to look at under a microscope. We haven't done that for a while. I'll try and get just the small stuff here. It's always interesting. And now I'll grab some of the other actual beach sand too, that's even finer. Got about that much, I'll put some beach sand in there. Some finer sand made up out of the same stuff, I'm sure. And we'll look at it.
just endless beautiful greens down here. Littles, bigs, clears. Super clear quartz. Just nice. These are all green chunks of chert. Massive clips of it somewhere around here breaking off into the sea. All the different shades. All of it semi translucent. Please be careful when you go to the ocean, especially when you're in the rocky areas. Leave yourself a way to get out, be prepared to swim. Look at these greens. There's my hall of green stones. Oh yeah. Is it sea glass? Yeah, it's a mermaid tier sea glass. And it's red, so red and violet and stuff are like the most rare. Yes! I, I found the red mermaid tears. Are you impressed? I'm SpongeBob. Come on, SpongeBob, we can sell this one at the store.